Let me tell you. Like a baby, but you know I'm about to keep you up. Welcome to my channel, and today I'm about to teach you something. I can make it pop, legs up, back to can't can with the neighbors up. Make it sound like the band pop. Bitch, let me get cute. Hey, y'all. Happy Friday. Welcome back to another vlog. My name is Tatiana. If you are new here, do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It's another house vlog. It's another it's another house vlog. Like what's new, what's new? Y'all I thought I saw a bug. I've been getting bit up by mosquitoes, so I'm like on alert. But anywho, it is another house vlog. So I'm currently in my last vlog, y'all saw I was organizing my um my desk with like my makeup and stuff is at. I had to order some more um of those clear organizer things because I needed some bigger ones so I think everything is pretty much good like how it's gonna be but y'all I told y'all I have so much stuff so like I have I have so much stuff so I really tried to like make it work so I'm gonna show y'all the finished product so this is how it looks this is the um the big drawer so i pretty much put my foundations and concealers together and then my um setting powder eyebrow stuff sharpeners there all my brushes and then i put my main like lip glosses and stuff here at the top and then down here down here i have eyeshadows because i don't really use eyeshadow that much my main palette i use is this one and then sometimes I'll use that one. But I pretty much use this one. And um, these are all um, eyeshadow palettes. And then I put like some lipsticks and glosses that I don't really use. Um, so, yeah. so this drawer has um, lipsticks, blush, and like um, mascara. And... Um, I think that's it. Mascara, eyeliner, and stuff like that. And then this one, I have my powders and highlighters. Um, so bronzers, powders, highlighters, loose and um, solid, I guess. These and then my loose ones. And then my Fenty um, body oil. And then at the very top, I have my setting sprays, my poofs, puffs, whatever, beauty blenders, and primer. So, yeah. That, I don't know why. Um, I feel like it was blurring, but I don't know why it was looking like that. But that's pretty much um, how I organized my desk. I have some of these little containers left over, so... Maybe I'll try to find use for them elsewhere. So yeah, and also y'all, I really don't know why I just said happy Friday in my vlog because today is Saturday. I just thought it was Friday because I worked today and I usually don't work on, um, I usually don't work on Saturdays. So I'm like, happy Friday. And today is Saturday, like Saturday evening too, about to be nighttime. But, um, yeah, so right now I am trying to get this room together. Nothing's going to go in here right now because I'm really not focused on trying to get this room together because I have to get other stuff for the house, like stuff for downstairs, bar stools, dining room table, chairs. We still need stuff for the room. So this is probably going to be like the last thing. So... Y'all, part two of hearing noises while I'm here by myself, okay? That has to be the neighbors. It has to be people outside. Anyways, yeah, so right now I'm just about to go through these boxes that's in here organized, put everything away just to clear it out so it could be like no junk on the floor. Um, I'll probably do like sit down videos in here and maybe like I'll make reels or something in here in the meantime, but it's going to be no furniture, no decorations, but I kind of want to create like a cozy vibe in here. Something like, I feel like, um, because the house, like our bedroom and downstairs and stuff is going to be neutral. I kind of want this room to have color, but then I kind of want it like all white and gold for some reason, like. 
I just love that look. I'll probably do color in here. Um, I want to put like a TV. I want to get an LED light. Um, I want to put like a little couch in here. Um, yeah, a rug and stuff, some shelves. So that's how I want to do it in here. Um, but that's not going to be no time soon, like I said, y'all. So I need like a good thousand dollars just for this room alone. Probably more with the furniture. Um, so yeah, that's, um, a work in progress, but I did some exciting stuff today. So like I said, y'all, I had to go to work. I went to Home Goods, Target. I got my eyebrows done. I went and got my car washed and I went to Verizon, y'all, because your girl got a new phone. So y'all know, I'm pretty sure y'all know the new iPhone came out. So your girl had to get it because I have the 12, 11. I think I have the 12. I know I don't have the last one. Um, so this is how it looks. Does it look the same? I feel like this one is darker than my phone. So this is my, what is it? It feels kind of like heavier. The camera lenses are bigger. Okay, let's compare, let's compare, let's compare. I have the 12 Pro. This is the 14 Pro. Um, so already I can tell that this one is darker, so like y'all see, they're both black, or this is, this is not space gray, is it? Did they change the color? I don't know. I just told her I wanted black. So this is how this one looks. This is how this one looks. It's darker. Y'all can see that the camera is bigger, but the phone is the same size, um, I feel like they're the same. I feel like it's the same, but the this one feels heavier to me. And I gotta order a case. Because what? Let me charge it. I don't know if it's charged. So I'm about to set this one up. I'm about to set that up. So I could get my new phone together because y'all, I strictly got this phone for content purposes. Like, I don't know. I need my content and everything to be on point. I need it to be clear. I just feel like my phone is not clear. Like, is that just like a me thing? I don't know, y'all. So I'm going to set that up. And then I wanted to show y'all what I got from Target, from Target. Oh, so I had to take those mirrors back. I took those mirrors back, y'all, um, because they are not long enough. I need some bigger mirrors. And then I'm still trying to decide now. I'm trying to decide if I want the oval or if I want the square. So I don't know. I'm trying to decide. Y'all help me decide. Let me know in the comments what mirrors y'all think I should get. Y'all think I should get square mirrors or y'all think I should get oval mirrors? Or circles, whatever they're ovals long, okay. Um, so I did get this new foundation, y'all. I wanted to try, um, show y'all this while I was over here. Um, the new NARS uh light reflecting foundation because I heard it was good and I love NARS, y'all. I want to try it, so I hope. I hope this is my size. I threw my other NARS foundation away, y'all, because... Did I throw it away? Yeah, I did. I kept one, though. I don't know why I kept... I kept Sheer Glow, but my Natural Radiant I threw away. But I had it for years, so I was probably just, like, throwing away expired stuff. So I got this one. Hopefully, this is still my shade. And hopefully it worked, girl, because I don't like... I will return, but I don't like opening stuff, trying it, and then taking it back. Because, you know, it could have been this for somebody else. It's just wasting, like, a whole bottle of freaking foundation. So, yeah, I have to send my, my phone back. And then I got um, a glass screen protector, y'all. These have lifetime warranties. I don't know if y'all ever had the Invisible Shield, the glass. 
um, protector, but you have to sign on and like register and stuff. And I think you have to do it within like 30 days or something because I always forget. I always forget and mess up and end up missing it. But the lady of Verizon, she was telling me that you can get a new like glass screen protector for life, like forever. Let me show y'all, y'all. I'm so aggravated. I'm like shadow banned on Instagram. Every freaking reel I post, it's like barely getting views. I don't know what's happening. Like I went from like 90,000, 50,000, 20,000 to like a thousand. This is ridiculous. It's so annoying. So let me show y'all what I got from Tarjay. I got some, I got quite a bit of stuff. So y'all. Y'all know I love scrubs. Y'all know I love fragrances, body wash, smelling good, all that. So I was in Target today and I saw this scrub from Tree Hut. And I really like Tree Hut scrubs, but I was like, I have some scrubs. So I want to use those first before I get another one. But I just emptied out two bottles of two different scrubs. So I was like, okay, I could get one. Um, that's how I ra rationalized my spending. But anywho, so I've never seen this one before. It's the Tropic Glow Firming Sugar Scrub. And what made me pick it up? I think my, let me lock my screen cause, from my laptop because it's like a glare and I don't like that. Okay, it'll turn black soon, hopefully. Okay, so this right here is the Tree Hut Firming Sugar Scrub. And I got this because I saw that it said firming. So I'm like, ooh, okay, I'll try it. So I smelt it, y'all. This smells just like the Bum Bum Cream. The Bum Bum Cream Scrub, the one, the dupe I showed y'all from Trader Joe's. I don't know if I showed y'all or my Instagram, um, but the the seasonal the seasonal scrub and lotion, it was like Brazil Nut Body Butter and Brazil Nut Body Scrub from Trader Joe's. It was supposed to be like a Bum Bum Cream dupe. This smells just like those, just like both of them. And I know that it does because for one, I've had both. And it also smells like the Amber Vanille, Amber Vanille, but not Vanille, Amber Vanille by Laura Mercier. And y'all, this says it's made with shea butter, kapwaku butter, and pistachio. And those are the same things that the Bum Bum Cream is. They both have pistachio. So it must be that, y'all, because this smells just like it. It smells so good. Mm. It smells good, y'all. Y'all gotta y'all gotta get this from Target if y'all don't want to spend forty dollars on a scrub. I got some basic stuff, y'all. So I pretty much it's so loud. I got the melanin melanin sleep ow melanin sleep soap from Dr. Seals because I'm trying to be knocked out. I got this um machine washing machine cleaner. Clean y'all washing machines. That's all I'm gonna say. Cause I know y'all don't be cleaning them. Clean y'all washing machines. That's supposed to clean them. Well, this is for, I think you're supposed to clean them like once a month. Helps remove odor causing residue in any washer. So I'll be using these. And they're also on my Amazon store. And I got this Method Hard Floor Cleaner. Spearmint Sage. Clean the floor. I got this Myers. Hand soap, acorn scents. I'm gonna put this downstairs um, in the kitchen because it's fall scent. It smells really good. I wanted to try this Frenchy Frenchy brand because I've been seeing it and I've been hearing about it, so I wanted to try it. I got the Cashmere Vanilla Soothing Body Serum Stick infused infused with magnesium and squalene. So you're just supposed to glide this onto your skin. Um, it says anywhere, anytime. So this is like a little body serum stick. And then I wanted to try, I could not, oh, I got this one. Okay, so y'all, this um, body wash is the bergamot and cedar one. And this one has oat extract and niacinamide. And I was trying to decide between this one and the citrus amber. I liked both of them. I probably got this one because I was like, hmm, kind of smells like 
earthy, like manish. I don't know. I was like, I don't, I don't have nothing like this, but it's like a really fresh scent. And then I got this um, diffuser. So I've seen like everybody talking about the pompous candle, but they didn't have the pompous candle. So I just got the pompous diffuser and I'm glad I got this. It makes sense because in our master bathroom, the toilet is separate and it doesn't have like any type of plug for you to plug a plug in in or anything like that so the diffuser i feel like the diffuser will be good in there help keep it smelling good because you know people be dookie in here that's what i got today so um yeah i just wanted to check in with y'all start this new vlog i need to edit um because i want to post a vlog tomorrow so i'll probably do that and i'm starving i have not ate all day all i had today was some fruit and some chips so i'll probably eat and then edit shower clean up this room and then i will check in with y'all set my phone up and then that'll be it for tonight because it's already 8 45 so by the time i'm done who knows what time it'll be so yeah i will check in with y'all tomorrow hi guys long time no see i keep saying that long time no see no talk y'all i'm trying to get better i'm trying to get back on my ish i was just talking about that in my sit down video which y'all will probably see before this one. Hopefully, if I get it edited and everything, I will post it on Thursday. Today's Tuesday. So, happy Tuesday. Um, I don't think y'all saw me since like last week when I got my new phone. Um, y'all haven't been vlogging, haven't really been doing anything. Um, but I thought that I would come thought I would come on here and check in with y'all since I'm actually looking like something today because y'all know like I'm always busted and I'm tired of being busted y'all but in my video if I don't have nothing going on I'm not gonna vlog um so I have to do I need to start doing other videos but um what I was gonna say was this weekend y'all I'm cutting my hair Oh, I don't know how much I'm going to cut yet. I said like three, four inches. I just need like a good refresh, restart. Um, I noticed like my hair hasn't been growing and I've been straining a lot. I just want to like hydrate it. I'm going to get a treatment and I'm going to get my hair straightened and cut. Not trimmed. I'm getting it cut. And we'll see how it goes. I'm going to probably try to like... I'm going to stop like putting heat on it because this year y'all put a lot of heat on my hair like in the beginning of the year in the beginning of the year hold on so I'm just cleaning up because I just did a sit down video like I said so I have like stuff everywhere um but yeah I'm going to try to stop putting heat on my hair in the beginning of the year I was putting so much heat on my hair because I was wearing clip-ins so like for my birthday heat um for my proposal because you know I thought it was a photo shoot so I got my hair done I got heat and then after that I was wearing ponytails heat like every time I wore a ponytail I was my hair was getting straightened and I didn't even realize like I didn't even realize it y'all like it was like damn i'm putting heat my hair all the time until like i looked at these old videos y'all my hair was like it wasn't super curly but it was my curls were way more defined than they are now and um it looked like more thick and uh, i'm sad so i'm like i need to cut it because I've been looking at my hair. I have a lot of like split ends that are like up here that like a trim is never going to get. And I know you can't like get all the split ends out your hair, but that's going to be a lot. It's going to be a lot of them. And I noticed the last time I took my braids out, y'all know like when people, when your hair is like straight or blow dried or whatever, and like where you can see through it at, that's what you need to cut. And I'm not attached. Like, if my hair, if me cutting my hair is going to make my hair grow even longer and thicker and healthier, I'll cut it. Like, I did a big chop a few years ago, 
and like my hair i couldn't even put in a ponytail it literally was so short it was like to my ears i'm not cutting it that much this time though. i'm not gonna cut it that much but i am gonna cut it more than a trim it's gonna be like you know a little more than a trim but right now like i said i just got done filming and i just wanted to check in i just thought i just got done cooking too i was trying to multitask y'all let me tell you how hello fresh has me up yet again like am i gonna have to cancel them for good like i'm gonna have to just chunk up the deuces because y'all this is the third time this is the third or fourth time that my my food has not been delivered and i just can't seem to understand why last time they told me oh change your delivery date i did that i've even moved so i'm just really confused as to why my food is not coming because y'all take my money on time y'all always take my money but y'all are not delivering my food like Y'all let me know in the comments if y'all do HelloFresh and y'all have ever had the same issue because all the people that I know that that do HelloFresh, they've never they've never talked about this. And I'm trying to figure out what's tea. Like what's going on? Why have I not been getting my fucking packages? Like why have I not been getting my meals? It's such an inconvenience. So I said all that to just say that I had to cook today. So I had to go to the grocery store and I had to cook. So I made some baked lemon pepper wings, some collard greens, and some rice and gravy. Yes, I cooks. I cooks. Okay, I'm a wife. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so I was cooking that and then trying to film. So I kept having to go upstairs, downstairs to check on the food. Um, so I'm done with everything now. So I'm about to eat and shower and go to sleep. But I'm, like, looking real cute. I'm trying to decide if I should like film a reel or something while I'm looking cute. I don't know. Um, probably not. <laughs> I really wanted to film um before I uh, um I wanted to film before I took my hair down, get a video out. Um, because I mean I'm getting my hair straightened. At first I wasn't, but I'm just like I might as well because. I just feel like, so I was getting a hydration treatment, I was going to get a hydration steam treatment, and I was just going to get my hair washed and blow dried and cut, and then I was just going to like put in a ponytail or something. And so, um, the girl that's doing my hair, she asked me, and I was like, no, I don't want to put heat in it, but then I'm like, I might as well get my hair done because paying $50 for a shampoo and blow dry is insane. Like, I might as well just get my hair straightened because i'm not about to pay 50 dollars to get my hair washed and blow dried and not done like that's crazy to me because i could just pay 40 more dollars to get it done so that's just what i'm gonna do um and then after that now for homecoming my hair that i want to do for homecoming i do want to have um probably either clip-ins or sewing or whatever um extensions and then after that the heat is through y'all it's through like I'm for real, I'm getting braids. I'm getting braids. And that's just, I'm just gonna have to be Braidiana. So, yeah, y'all, it's 10 o'clock. Oh, it's 10 o'clock. So, I'm about to eat and, um, oh, ooh, I will check in with y'all later, um, with some home updates. Well, should I just show y'all now? Let's just go downstairs let's just go let's just go so y'all um i just wanted to show y'all this because i don't know what's going on with this lighting hello home updates so we are ordering we're currently like ordering more furniture i don't know if i told y'all which i think that i did but i ended up ordering another bed because i wanted a king and the bed that i got i didn't really want so i ended up getting a king um and then we ordered some more stuff my couch got delayed i don't remember if this happened the last time i talked to y'all but my couch got delayed a whole month y'all so it's not coming until like the end of october which 
aggravates me so bad. It aggravates me because when I first ordered it, it said it was going to ship between September 5th and the 15th. They emailed me like, oh, it's just kidding. It's going to ship on between October 10th and 15th or something. Something like that. October 10th. Um, so couch is coming, but we have been looking at more like decor and stuff like that. Um, but nothing's here yet. Nothing's here for me to show y'all yet, but I did want to show y'all. I did organize the pantry. So I did get like these organizers to organize the pantry. So I just put a little bit of stuff that I had, fruit snacks, chips, hot chocolate, popcorn, ramen noodles. You know, we've been struggling because the Hello Fresh ain't come. So we have to eat some ramen noodles. Um, and it was a mess in here, y'all. So I kind of just like cleaned it up, put stuff in places. The seasonings are in this box right here because I'm going to have like a seasoning drawer with like a seasoning rack and redo like all the seasonings, label them, all that. We did end up cleaning out the garage. Um, I don't know if I told y'all, but a lot of stuff was in the garage. So we ended up cleaning that out. Um, I just have to, I took a lot of stuff to Goodwill on Sunday. Um, and I just have to, the other stuff I'm going to try to sell. Like I have like a bed frame, a desk. Um, I think that's it. And then I just have some more clothes that I need to take to donate to Goodwill also. And then the fridge, y'all. So the fridge, it looks better when... It looks better when I first did it because obviously stuff was full. We've been eating it and drinking it. But I did my Capri Suns and I got these like little ghost squeeze applesauce um, pouches, yogurt, water, milk, my oat milk there. And then I just have like drinks. I do want to end up like making fresh juice, but I also want to take um, this stuff out of the container and put like in like a glass um jar but i just don't have those yet and then i have like these things too that i put fruit in um yeah so i did that this weekend but other than that y'all i don't have nothing else to show y'all i could show y'all the wall though it's finally like painted and complete and then jt ooh, and then jt changed the light fixtures um i, I mean they're not light fixtures but he changed all these things with the switches and the plugs. He changed them in here to black. We still have to change this. I have to find a light for that. And we're changing um, we're changing that ceiling fan too. But yeah, like all the plugs are black. And this is the wall, y'all. So it looks really nice, black. Nice little accents with the wood, add some character. And then we was taping off the living room because we trying to see like how big the couch is for like um the size coffee table we want to get and stuff like that. Um so yeah. And we painted, well I didn't paint, but JT painted because that was a whole nother issue. So yeah, we're just waiting on furniture. Just waiting on furniture. But yeah, so that's it for today, y'all. Um, I'm about to eat. Like I said, I need to make the gravy because I've been vlogging, so I didn't have time. But yeah, so that's what I'm about to do. So good night. Good night. I will chat with you later. Hello everyone. <laughs> I look insane. Like literally I'm about to go get my hair done. So I told y'all happy Saturday. Today is Saturday. I told y'all in the last clip, I believe I was getting my hair done. I'm going to get my hair cut. I told y'all I was cutting it. I'm not cutting it a lot, but I don't know how much I'm gonna cut yet. I have to see it like blown out, but probably like, I don't know, y'all have to see. Anyways, I came on here to show y'all my hair because look at this. I just took my hair down and my hair is so crusty. Like it's so flaky and dry. This is another reason why I'm going to get um, a hydration treatment. And I'm going to just start, like, I don't feel like I don't 
I don't feel like I'm not not taking care of my hair, but I'm about to start taking care of it better because my scalp is always dry like this. And y'all see this part in the front. This is what I just had um, out. That's why it's more straight than the rest. So we're about to go get this done. And then I'm going to be coming back looking better than ever. JT keeps <laughs> JT keeps saying I got a BBL, y'all. I don't know why. I don't know why. Here, tell them. You have a BBL. <laughs> you know that. No, tell them why. Why you keep saying that? I don't because have a BBL. Because everybody got a BBL. I came out. Uh, I <laughs> went to work one day and you looked the same way the night before. I come back to home and I saw your body the next day and it looked totally different. You got a BBL done. <laughs> He's crazy. Y'all, I told y'all I done picked up a little weight. I have picked up a little weight. And he trying to get me, he trying to get me to work out, but he said he don't want me to lose my legs and butt. He really just want my stomach flat. He want me to look exactly the same, but with a flat stomach. That's really what he want. And it's not flat right now, y'all. I'm gonna just tell y'all that it's not. Okay, I have to get back. I have to I have to get back on my stuff. I'm not selfish and I'm not stingy. My hair is giving. I just got electrocuted. So yeah, my appointment is at 2.30. But it's like, depending on traffic, probably like 45 minutes to an hour away. So I'm going to probably leave. I need to run some errands, but I can't run no errands looking like this. So... Get my hair done first and then take care of what I can take care of. So I will check in with y'all later when I'm getting my hair done. Um, I'll probably do like a little montage. That is so nasty. I cannot wait to get my hair washed. It feels so good. I can't wait. So I'll check in with y'all once I'm at the shop. Oh gee. Y'all, I look so crazy. Um, I did a little damn, do I need to go get gas? I don't know. Maybe. I think I can make it. Um, but y'all, I put my hair up in this ponytail. Um, I did a little makeup because um I may go bowling after I get my hair done, depending on how long it takes, because bowling is at 4.30. My appointment is at 2.30. So hopefully, maybe, they'll still be there when I go. Oh, I'm trying to put this damn stuff belt on. But yeah, I just, I just put a little makeup on, a little natural beat. Um, where I'm going to get my hair done, I think it's like 45 minutes away, like I said. I'm going to put it in my GPS. But yeah, bowling is in Marietta, which I think isn't too far away from where I'm at. But I'm going like Roswell, Roswell Road, I think. Yeah, Roswell Road. It says it's 34 minutes away. So, I'm about to go there. I'll probably stop and get gas because I have 48 miles left. And this is 30 miles away. Dang, 30 miles away? That's a little ways, okay? But yeah, um, I can't wait. I'm so excited. I can't wait to get my hair washed and I can't wait to like trim it and kind of do a restart i was gonna tell y'all earlier i forgot to tell y'all so i'm not playing about my hair y'all so this lady that i found on instagram her clients y'all she got their hair growing so fast and so good it, all of her clients hair has been growing like crazy so she has these products now she taking new clients. I don't know when she opens up her books, but I guess you get like products and you get your hair done and she tells you like, you know, she gives you like a regimen, like what you need to do. $750. $750. But y'all, the results are like amazing. So I ended up ordering her products. She did a restock today 
And I probably won't be going to her because $750, like, to get my hair done, that's insane. <laughs> but, <laughs> um, she has her products. She's only, I guess, she restocked, she said, for three days or until products are gone or whatever. So, I hurried up and went on there. And she has, um, I got all three of her products. She has three things. She has a pre-poo and sealing oil, a follicle and strand moisturizer riser and a protein potion so i'm gonna see um what is given the business is called nasara nasara organics um so yeah i'm gonna start using that on my hair and i'm gonna start taking probably some hair vitamins and i'm going to um not touch my hair like with them with that heat and stuff and then i'm going to get regular trims and we'll see what it's gonna do so yeah about to start driving talk to you later you Right where I had it at first. I just wanted to make sure before I had more done. I'm gonna put that white cake on you so they can see how long it is on the back. Okay. You're gonna have to get the back because I can't see. <laughs> you know how hot are you? No. Mm -hmm. Before I get it cut, this is how it is. <laughs> I'm really not gonna. Well, we'll see. I'm not gonna say nothing. Y'all can't see no way from the back. Okay. <laughs> Don't have me looking crooked. <laughs> I said it somewhere.
I ain't got a clue, bro. Yes, get into it. It looks so good. I've been having my hair straight in a minute. You can come in and smash it to have your light on. But it's supposed to move though, right? Yeah. Take the big comb and paint it through. This camera's so big. I'm trying to get it. What kind of camera am I supposed to get when I get there? You should get it. We bowling, y'all. Everybody starting off strong. 
left game night it was so fun <laughs> it was so fun like they was cracking me up it was hella funny um but i just wanted to show y'all a little bit i feel like i showed y'all um a little bit when i was at the shop but i wanted to show you my hair so what i did was i got a hydration treatment and then i got a cut and a silk press and i just really love my hair like i feel like it looks so shiny and healthy and stuff so and we didn't cut too much off so which I'm happy about because I thought I was gonna have to cut more but I didn't end up having to cut as much as I thought so we good um but I'm about to um JT is going out so I'm about to just shower and watch the Dahmer documentary thing because it's just crazy. Like, I never heard about the story. So, like, people was like, oh, if you watch it, you're, like, insensitive to the people that actually went through it. Like, you just want, you find um, entertainment and other people's trauma. But I don't, I'm not watching it for that. I just think, like, I never heard of it. And everybody's talking about it. And I just think it's a very crazy sick story. Sick story. And I just want to learn about it. Because I don't know nothing about what happened. So, he doesn't like uh, shows like that. So I have to watch it when he's gone. So I'm going to probably just watch that and go to sleep. But I need a snack. I don't know. I got some um some pumpkin toffee cake things in the um free in the freezer that I could put in the oven with some ice cream. It sounds so good. 
her makeup then came on off, y'all. I had did my makeup. I told y'all I did my makeup um because I knew that we was going somewhere after I got my hair done. And y'all, I didn't even realize like when I when I had got um the steam treatment, the hydration treatment, you know, you gotta sit under the steamer and the water just dripping all down my face, messed up my makeup, took all my makeup off my eyebrow. Uh, you could cut it off if you about to get out because I got to wrap my hair. It just is late, okay? Bree did that. My hair looks so shiny and healthy. I love it. But yeah, after this, I'm not putting no heat. Maybe for homecoming, but I'm not sure. So, yeah, I will be going to sleep. This is the end of this vlog. Thank you for watching. I have to edit this all tomorrow and post it tomorrow because y'all know I said I'm back on my stuff. So I'm going to try to get y'all two videos a week. So thank you for watching. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram and I will talk to you later. Good night.